Welcome to Under the Microscope. This series is brought to you by the Real Scientists Nano team. Our goal is to provide a platform where scientists can communicate their work and interact with the public. With that in mind, every week we introduce you to a scientist working in the field of materials and nanoscience, who would be curating the Real Sci Under Scroll Nano Twitter account. Hi everyone, today we have with us Andrea Armani, who is a professor of chemical engineering and material science at the University of Southern California. Hi Andrea, how are you? Uh, good, uh, thank you for having me. We are very, very happy to have you. So let's start by understanding your research. Could you explain your research in super simple words to us, please? Um, so my research is developing new materials, so new uh, light emitting materials, and using them in either diagnostics or integrated optics applications. So making, for example, new types of lasers or new ways of actually imaging uh, how cells, biological cells, interact with each other. So kind of a wide range of applications, uh, mm -hmm. but it, it all kind of starts with uh, developing a new material. Aha, uh -huh. okay. So what kind of materials are you working with? Yes, I realize my answer is very vague. <laughs> but we, we actually uh, work with a lot of different material systems. Uh, mm -hmm. So we develop new uh, organic materials. Uh, so new, uh, you know, light emitting materials that could be a pyridinium material. So, you know, we're now getting into the technical words. Mm -hmm. um, or they could be inorganic materials. So new types of quantum dots. And, you know, Quantum dots have obviously been around for a very long period of time, uh, but we're looking at developing quantum dots that don't have heavy metals in them. So the, a lot of the original quantum dots had cadmium and you know that's not great for the environment. So we're looking at making new types of quantum dots that don't have heavy metals, so they're better for the environment. So that's, uh -huh. that's some of the material work we're, we're doing. And then you know, obviously once you have a new material, New materials lead to new technologies, and new technologies lead to new science. So you know it's a it's a cascade. So it's Absolutely. always exciting, you know, to see where Absolutely. everything goes. Absolutely! Wow, that sounds really cool. I hope you can tell us all about the organic LEDs <laughs> and uh, imaging the cells uh, with the yeah. lasers and stuff and all of that while you're taking over the the Twitter account. So. Yeah. What can the followers expect in the week that you will be taking over the Real Scientist Nano Twitter account? So first off, I really hope everybody, you know, engages. It's not just me, you know, spitting out information. <laughs> um, otherwise, you know, as a professor, we can always just talk forever. <laughs> uh, but I'm, I'm hoping to both share some of the recent discoveries in the field, not just my lab, uh, but also a little bit more about career advice. I've always found, you know, advice is, helpful. It doesn't matter where you are in your career. And I've noticed kind of over the last few years that uh, on my personal Twitter account, uh, advice seems to be the most popular type of tweets. And I've mm -hmm. kind of curated a couple of the, the best tweets over the last few years. And I'm planning on kind of reposting those. And some are from me, some are from other faculty, but just life advice. Uh, you know, taking different people's opinions and uh, coalescing them. Uh, so, you know, some of these may be more appropriate for early career researchers. Some will be more appropriate for later stage researchers. Uh, mm -hmm. But it's really going to be a blend of science and uh, you could call them life hacks, right? Like how to <laughs> how to not make the mistakes that other people have made. Because uh, the best way to learn is to not repeat uh, failures. So. Absolutely, absolutely. That's that's really nice that uh, you're not just going to talk about your research, but also the research in your field. So the research of the community, and also you have already started uh, putting together a list of advices or life hacks, uh, yeah. as we can call them. Uh, very, very much looking forward to the advice and the science and everything that you can tell us. Um, while you're taking over the account. Thank you very much. This was a lot of fun and looking forward to having you on Real Scientist Nano. Thank you. I'm, I'm excited about it. Thank you for listening. To know more about us, please visit our website, realscientistsnano.org.
and follow us on Twitter at realsa underscore nano.